The Bills hosting the Titans on Sunday. It's time once again to meet the Mafia. Throughout the season, we will feature Bills super fans before every home game. And today we're highlighting a true pioneer for Buffalo's female fans. With an incredible streak of consecutive Bills games under her belt, Joshua Robinson caught up with today's super fan coming home from Green Bay, Feather Boa, Sundress and all. All the kids, you know, know me, and I feel like their mom. Joni Podkowinski de Coker has plenty of nicknames, but she loves when fellow super fans like Pancho Billa call her Bill's mom. I never had kids, and I thought if I, if I had kids, I would want him to be my son. Joni started watching Bill's games with her dad at 11 years old. And he could not be disturbed during those three hours, so like I, I made him teach me football. Today, Joni is married, but only gets to see her husband, David, two or three times a year. He lives in California, she lives in New York, taking care of her mom, who was diagnosed with dementia. When my mom was getting sick, he goes, you really should go back and take care of her, and I'm really glad I'm here. But David also supported Joni's love of the Bills, so she started going to every Bills game, home and away, but she needed an outfit. One of my best friends was a um, seamstress. Actually, she made my wedding dress, too. So um, she made me my first Bills dress. And I wore it the first time to a game here in 1998. That game, I got my first hat, a straw hat with the big bow in the back. And I, I thought, oh my god, that would really make my outfit. The pins came a little later. Including the very first pin her dad gave her 50 years ago. I have nightmares that I pins drop off my hat and I and it's like I don't know they're dropping off and like I'll, I'll look at the hat later and it's empty. Isn't that something? Tell That's me terrifying. I'm not neurotic. <laughs> now Joni has seen 129 consecutive Bills games live home and away but it's worth every penny, every minute, every mile she says when young fans call her a role model. I was like, really? You know, I'm just a fan. But they, I think it's because I'm, I'm a, a woman. There's a lot of woman fans now, but it's still in the minority. When I started at 11 years old, I didn't realize how in the minority I must have been then, you know? Joshua Robinson, Channel 2 News. That is dedication. You know, he said it's worth every penny. Well, how much does it cost? Joni says it's about ten to twelve thousand dollars each year to do what she does, travel to all the Bills games. But she says that she usually stays with friends and family to try to save some money. Yeah, and Sunday's going to be 130 in a row. Joni says that she's got another 30 years left of games in her, and she doesn't plan on stopping until she sees the Bills win a Super Bowl in person. Good luck to her.